We are hurtling toward the day when climate change could be irreversible. I've seen sea levels already altering this nation's coast. China's capital is choking in its worst pollution of the year. Five percent of species will become extinct. Sea levels rising, glaciers melting. Okay, enough. I get it. Every person in every country and every continent will be impacted in some shape or form by climate change. There is a climate cataclysm looming and we are underprepared for what this could mean. Climate change is caused by human activities and the treatment life of our own Earth as we know it. Uh, with rising greenhouse gas emissions, climate change is occurring at rates much faster than, than anticipated. Its impacts can be devastating and include extreme and the changing weather patterns and rising sea levels. What do you think? What is the typical estimate of water consumption for hygiene purposes per person per day? I think it's about, I think it's about uh, three gallons a day, maybe. That's the best guess I don't have. It is such a complicated and long question. Uh, approximately from twenty to forty liters. Uh, hello, I think uh, that's about fifty liters per day. Так, um, полтора литра на питье, литров десять на мытье, литров пятнадцать-двадцать, наверное. This might seem surprising. After all, on average, people only drink about two liters of water a day. But water plays a hidden role in our daily lives, and in that same 24 hours, most people will actually consume an estimated 3,000 liters of water. In fact, household water, which we use to drink, cook, and clean, accounts for only 3.6% of humanity's water consumption. Another 4.4% goes to the wide range of factories, which make the products we buy each day. But the remaining 92% of water consumption is all spent on a single industry, agriculture. Our farms train equivalents of 3.3 billion Olympic sized swimming pools every year. All of it swallowed up by crops and livestock. Now, let's talk about the nature of the problem. A sense. Climate change represents a complex area of environmental challenges that threatens the delicate balance of our planet's ecosystems and the well-being of human societies. This issue underscores the urgent need for understanding and action to address the root causes of environmental degradation. Cause. At the core of climate change lie under beginning factors, human activities that have significantly altered the Earth's natural processes. The burning of fossil fuels, industrial emissions, the extraction of natural resources, and unsustainable consumption patterns have all contributed to the increase in greenhouse gas emissions. Effects Climate change has widespread and significant impacts affecting regions across the globe and all aspects of life. This includes displacing communities due to rising sea levels, reducing biodiversity, and increasing natural disasters. It puts stress on ecosystems and threatens food and water security, especially for vulnerable populations. Solution To address climate change, we need a comprehensive approach involving individual action, collective efforts, and innovative solutions. It's crucial to raise awareness about its causes and consequences for informed decision-making and behavioral change. Transitioning to eco-friendly transportation, adopting renewable energy, and implementing carbon pricing mechanisms are essential steps to reduce emissions and mitigate climate change. So here is some real solution for this problem. First is policy reform. Governments can enact policies and regulations that incentivize sustainable practices such as current pricing, emissions trading systems, and renewable energy subsidies. By creating a supportive regulatory uh, framework, policymakers can encourage businesses and individuals to adopt environmentally friendly behaviors. So next is education and awareness. Investing in education and awareness programs can empower individuals and communities to make informed choices about the consumption habits and environmental impact. By fostering a culture of environmental stewardship, we can inspire collective action and drive meaningful change. 
So finally, is in innovation and technology. Continued uh, investment in research and development of clean energy technologies, carbon capture and storage, and sustainable agriculture practices can accelerate the transition to a low carbon economy, embarrassing innovation and harnessing the power of technology can unlock new solutions to combat climate change. To sum up, the time for action is now. Every small step, every conscious choice, and every collaborative endeavor contributes to the collective effort to address climate change and safeguard the well-being of our planet and future generations. Together, we have the power to shape a world where environmental resilience, social equity, and economic prosperity coexist harmoniously. Let us embrace this opportunity with determination, compassion, and resolve, knowing that our actions today will resonate far into the future. So, act now. <laughs>